I'm here at the Connect Arab Summit 2012 in Doha, Qatar, with Nagwa El Shanawi, Director of the Information Centre of the Ministry of Communication in Egypt. Nagwa, thank you very much for being with us today. Thank you. I'd like to start off by asking you, why is the Connect Arab Summit important for the region? I think because of many reasons. Because it's time, the Arab Summit coming now after the Arab Spring. And uh, this is very important, the changes happen in all uh, the Arab countries uh, last year and it continue to, to be changed during the next coming years. This is first. Second, because the ICT and the communication and information technology is becoming really an engine of growth and the Arab countries can benefit from the ICT and which can help them to be among the leader countries worldwide. And in terms of communications, what are the main challenges for communications in the region? Uh, the main challenge is it's really it's the broadband. It's uh, make the broadband available for every citizen in every country in the Arab region. This is first. Uh, second, it's make it affordable as well because this is very important. It's not only the accessibility is important but as well as the affordability. Uh, and the usage, how, how the people are going to use the broadband in the different application, in different project, in order really to, uh, to help them to, to develop their social class and uh, to have an economic impact finally by using all uh, th this new technology. You've just made an announcement here about a new portal at the Connect Arab Summit. Perhaps you could tell us a little bit about that. Yes, we just made an announcement in the presence of uh, the Secretary General of the ITU and the Minister of Communication of Egypt. It's about a new portal for ICT measurement in the Arab region. And uh, this portal is really it's the outcome of a very fruitful project uh, held during the last two years between the Minister of Communication in Egypt and the ITU Arab Regional Office. Uh, it will, the main objective of this project is to really to build the capacity of the region in area of measurements. Uh, the second is to really to define set of indicator benefiting from the international standards as well as uh, uh, adding to this uh, set of indicator also the aspects and the flavor of the Arab region in order to be very also useful for, for the region. So we just announced uh, the inauguration of this portal uh, today. Uh, and we also, we, uh, by this announcement, we try to uh, uh, explain for the countries how they are going to use because every Arab country will participate in putting their data, their indicator, their publication and use as well. Uh, and uh, we, ho we hope that this portal as well becoming in the future the main focal database uh, for all international organizations as well as the regional one. And uh, we are not stopping at this stage. We have a new stage. So also, during the announcement, I announced a new project between the Ministry of Communication in Egypt and the ITU Regional Office as well, to continue to build the capacity in the area of statistics, because this is important for every policymaker to follow up the development of the sector and to also to design and to set up the policies for the future. And how is communication within the region itself? The communication now, it's through the Arab region. It's, uh, we have focal points in the Arab region. So, and this is, was also one of the very important outcome of this project, to, to, to communicate together, to know each other. And uh, also we, ha we will have on the portal a discussion board, which will help us to communicate more and more and faster and to get the feedback on every issue related to the measurement um, very quickly, in, in no time, as we call it. Egypt's gone through very substantial changes recently. Um, how, how has that affected the Ministry of Communications? Uh, Egypt, it's, it's affected by all means and in all sectors, including the ICT sector. But really, um, the ICT sector within the, uh, the, the latest events and the revolution of the 25th, because the internet was behind this revolution, so it's, it's, uh, it is a positive impact <laughs> on the society at large and on changing uh, the, the, the society and the country uh, and to be more open to the democracy as well as to uh, people now can express themselves, can communicate faster, uh, can build the consensus 
using the ICT technology. So we found that it was uh, in addition to the bad impact because of the economic situation at large, but in the meantime, we have a positive impact from the other side because the number of users has been uh, developed and has been increased within the last few months is very tremendously than before. So it was one of the achievements. And really, I think now, after the political change happened in Egypt, this also will affect the image and the, the, of the Egypt in the future and will affect the ICT sector in a positive manner. Nagwa Shnawi, thank you very much for being with us. Thank you so much.